Hello, and welcome to the very first Benek special product event. First, let's start with the Benek TFS 200. Benek TFS 200 is basically a research equipment platform that, that grows with you. It has a it's been especially designed for a multi-user research environment with, with variable needs. The TFS 200 users can choose from a large number of options to have the most favorable system configuration. So options include large number of precursor sources, uh, load logs, plasma LD, high aspect ratio option with either with the reduce or stop flow modes, several different types of in situ analysis options and, and uh, also the particle ALD with the fluidized bed reactor. So I'll be talking about about our work with the uh, Benek TFS 200. Our Benek ALD family consists of uh, a an, uh, 2011 TFS 200 and then we recently this is actually a model year 2020 but we are still installing it so it's getting put into place and in 2019 we also uh, went with the fluidized bed reactor one of the things that has been touted over the years is uh, confining metal hydrides in nano structured materials we wanted to try the reverse of that where we coat a metal hydride with um, ald coatings and add in additives and hopefully be able to pull off some of the same kind of results and actually do better than uh, a nano confinement strategy. So initially, right off the bat, this material performed very well. So we, we were able to get um, the full capacity off at the first cycle. It basically it looks like extremely low um, loading is giving the results that we want. So we, we're pretty excited about where this, this ALD technology can take us. Welcome to the Benek R2 product update. Uh, we launched the Benek R2 two years ago at ALD 2019. The R2 is meant to be an affordable entry-level ALD tool. Uh, it's based on a flexible configuration that you can easily add options to. What we've been really working hard on for the past two years are the options that are addable on the R2 uh, and the processes uh, relating to these options. There are multiple options you can add to the R2. For example, you could add a 3D chamber and then a set of heated sources. The standard wafer chamber for thermal processing is for up to 200 millimeter substrates. The uniformity levels are high, typically for uh, standard oxides at a level of 1%. For plasma processing, we offer a plasma chamber that that relies on our 300 watt capacitively coupled plasma source. For the 3D chamber, this is meant for larger parts or wafer batch. We found that the homogeneity between wafers in the batch mode is really good. For low vapor pressure precursors, we offer a set of two heated sources. These are 200 milliliter volume containers that are heatable up to 200 degrees C. Then for stronger oxidants, we, we offer the ozone cabinet option. So this is a safe way to deliver ozone with the tool. Hello, my name is Mikko Saikkonen, Business Development Manager at Benek, and I'm introducing and presenting Genesis ALD Roll-to-Roll -roll system. The motivation for the Roll-to-Roll -roll ALD is the main three market sectors. Next generation batteries, passivation and uh, for cathodes and anodes and thin film coatings for solid state batteries. Conductive layers and encapsulation for the solar, flexible solar cells and moisture barrier for flexible electronics. Genesis roll to roll has two operating modes. Static, static coating head mode uh, is for uh, thin, like a one nanometer film and then the process speed is up to 30 meters per minute. For the thicker films, the uh, coating head can be oscillating, and then the line speed or the process speed is one meter per minute for 10 nanometer film. Benek Roll-to-Roll -roll ALD gives a direct scale-up to the mass production for protective coatings on anode, 
cathode and separators. Coating on particles, also in roll to roll is possible. And roll to roll for suitable 3D structures. And for the reference, one nanometer of ALD coating cost of ownership is less than one US dollar per square meter. In this product's special event, I'm excited to share an, an overview on a Benek Transform ALD cluster platform and specifically talk about how that platform can be used for technology development and bridging over to pilot scale manufacturing. Versatility emerges from the combination of thermal batch ALD as well as single wafer plasma ALD. Another benefit in this platform is a preheating module. We're taking wafers individually from the log block, preheating and preconditioning them, and then loading them onto the thermal batch module, essentially eliminating any waiting time on the module. The platform comes with two main frames. Benek Transform is able to house up to three process module in addition to the preheat. Benek Transform Lite is a smaller version which has a MX400 transfer module, which equally well can house the same process modules, be it either thermal or plasma, but this is net limited up to two process modules in addition to the preheating module. Both platforms can handle wafer sizes from, from three inch all the way to eight inch and have the sex game communication capability. As a reference point, we give a figure of merit for 50 nanometer aluminum oxide. So the thermal batch process modules is able to uh, generate 15 wafers per hour throughput. Uh, from just one process chain. But we've identified specific interest for plasma to enhance the film property and device electrical properties across these three categories. Specifically, you look at compound semiconductor power, for, like, uh, for example, gallium nitride or silicon carbide, uh, where interface states is, is an important factor. Uh, plasma clean and plasma deposition combined with oxide deposition is providing uh, additional benefits. With the plasma module, you may combine plasma as well as thermal processes. So those oxide I mentioned are also available on the plasma mode as a thermal operation. Having developed that specific film and, and application, you may then move forward to a, a pilot production regime where the Transform Light platform allows you to add more uh, capability and capacity. And then importantly, with this combination of plasma and thermal, you may add also sequencing, pre-cleaning, nitride deposition, and, and thermal deposition. So Transform Light can walk you through from the technology phase all the way to pilot. If you're looking at uh, increasing the, the tool capacity even further, then Transform Platform may be your, your uh, tool of choice. This is, of course, adding more capacity. And importantly, that platform has also some additional features, which I mentioned, like wafer cooling uh, integrated onto the mainframe that allows you to essentially extract further functionalities without affecting the tool throughput. Greetings. I have a pleasure to introduce you Benek P800 Batch ALD system. P800 ALD system is one of the largest ALD tools in the market. Batch size is up to 40 square meters, so it's a excellent tool for production. Substrate materials include uh, in, uh, glass, metal, silicon, ceramics, uh, polymers. You can choose from uh, seven different uh, reaction chamber options. In the case that you don't find the best option for you, we can customize uh, chamber for your needs and uh, we can go even over 600 millimeter wide uh, uh, sample sizes uh, when the chamber is customized. This year, the main changes uh, include source cabinet. It's easier, easier to handle. Uh, we have new cover plates, uh, and uh, then we have new back of control system for easy operation. And here, typical applications are anti-corrosion coatings on uh, different parts, depending on coatings for optics, electronics, and fuel cells. Hello. Today I'm going to talk to you about Benek C2R. So that is a new rotary spatial plasma enhanced ALD system offering ultra high deposition rates up to micrometers per hour. And uh, another advantage is that it makes uh, naturally single-sided coatings, unlike many other ALD systems. 
Uh, it can be used for thick substrates such as lenses with up to 30 millimeter thickness. Uh, it offers high film thickness uni uniformity, uh, which makes it especially suitable for optical coding applications, which demand thick films and high uniformities. The substrates are placed on the turntable and uh, are rotated through precursor zone and plasma zone multiple times during the process. And one revolution equals one ALD cycle. So with, uh, then we can run relatively high RPMs compared to the traditional pulsing of gases, which enable high deposition rates. So as an example, at 200 RPM, the ALD cycle time is, is 300 milliseconds. Uh, some of the very first results with aluminum oxide. Uh, here uh, we have uh, RPMs going from 50 to 100 and 200. Uh, Non-uniformity uh, is around 2% for the whole area. And uh, uh, growth rates, deposition rate, uh, with 200 RPM we are at 1.5 microns per hour, which uh, uh, in, in practice means that it takes only less than four minutes to deposit 100 uh, nanometers. So it's really, really fast. What a great day of updates and announcements. And there's one more thing. For years, our customers have relied on Benex P-series tools for large-scale ALD batch production. The story begins with the Benex P400A, which features an ALD vacuum chamber at 40 centimeters or nearly 16 inches in diameter. Its bigger cousin, the P800, houses an even larger vacuum chamber at a diameter of 80 centimeters or over 31 inches. We're now building the world's largest ALD reactor with a vacuum chamber at a whopping 170 centimeters or nearly 67 inches in width. Here you can see its size next to a passenger car. Here is a real life photo of the tool in assembly. We are excited to announce this new product on September 1st this year.